Hello my sunshines. You know I travel a lot for work and I wanted to take you on with the journey. So today we are flying to Orlando and then from there we're gonna go to Scottsdale, Arizona. All for business. So I'm gonna share with you what it feels like to travel for business all the time and what type of responsibilities and how it is. Let's see and let's go. But first, let's drink a coffee, do some work and hey, who's your daddy baby? <music> Just got to Orlando in the hotel. Woo! I think I'm gonna have like a little uh, room dining or something. I'm exhausted. See you tomorrow. It's been a long, very, very long first day. I'm exhausted. It's night. I didn't talk to you a lot today. I want to share a few things with you, such as a beautiful goodnight kiss. Stop it. Get some help. So here we go. And I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you. Day two. Here we go. <laughs> hey, beautifuls. Let's do a little game. We're going to count how many coffee or caffeine providers, suppliers, I'm going to have within this trip. Because, yes, this is one of the things that I have to do every time I go on a business trip and travel like a maniac because it's a non stuff. Hey guys, it's not holidays. It's work, literally work. So let's do a count. Yesterday I had three coffees. Today I'm gonna have the art rocks already and a matcha tea. We are at five. Oh, I had two coffees this morning as well, I forgot. So we had seven already. Today was a long day at CG, day two is finally finished. I mean, I had a great time, F man. I mean, it's, uh, it's just exhausting. Traveling around like this and stuff, you gotta keep it going. We finished the day at 6.45, then drink, and then restaurants, and now it's 10.15, and I'm finally getting to my room, and uh, well, guess what, I sleep. <laughs> Today is day three. I had my first workout and it was a pain, yes. So I'm about to hop on a meeting. Uh, let me know how this light does. I bought like this small light here. It looks like better. I forgot about it like in the past uh, couple of days, but I'm about to hop on a meeting. So we'll take care of this. And then day three starts with a big smile on my face. And yours too, I'm sure. Stay positive. Um pepene, motherfucker. <laughs> Morning meetings for you, bitch. <laughs> hey sunshines, <laughs> good morning. Don't worry, I'm gonna put a hat on, but first I need some caffeine. Mm. Day four of our journey here. And we are in Scottsdale, baby! And I finally had good coffee, holy f You know what? I slept three hours and I woke up out of a Celsius like you could see, but I got three coffees after I got out of this f plane to catch up with the bad coffees I got the last week. It was terrible. 
Starbuck. My friend Alex came to pick me up at the airport. We had like some good coffee, obviously, lunch and everything. And then now I'm driving to one of my house, 908. That's almost done with the construction. And uh, I'm just gonna sit there because all the furniture is already there and shit. And uh, I'm driving this beautiful Audi Q8 that we're gonna put on Turo together and partner up on Turo. Yeah. He's my man. <laughs> Welcome to our third Airbnb. So th actually we own this one. And uh, as you can see, all the furnitures are here. I mean, furnitures and other minor stuff, everything, plants, everything, fake plants. Remember, remember the last video? Um, so my goal here now for this couple of days is to finalize it. Now that we did this three out of four Airbnbs, I have like a whole process that I put in place and that's what I wanna do to make sure that when I travel, I don't have to do all these small things anymore. Other people are doing this for me. That's the goal. I wanna put my process in place on paper, document them and give them to my employees and my team that I already have in place now and so they understand the process. It's gonna be so much less work. Whew, that's how you do it. But you gotta do it yourself first so you know exactly what to expect from these people, right? You can't be a good boss or run a process properly if you don't know how to do it yourself. I always believe that doing your job, yeah, it's kind of resonating here. <laughs> I always believe that doing work yourself at first is always the best experience you can have. So then you can perform and train your people better. Hey, mark my words. <laughs> I always dream to say this shit. New apartments, shops, like it's just yeah. like, it's a developing area. We're saying Scottsdale, right? Scottsdale Tempe. This is Papago Mountain. Okay, got it. So we're right on the cusp. All right. But this is McDowell. So like now what I'm gonna do? It's uh, 8:17. I finished my day of work. I'm almost done. I have to set up the internet. Um, I'm taking off at 7 a.m. So you know, early rise, baby. Uh, tonight I'm going to see some friends here in Arizona. Anyway, let's get going and uh, take the plane tomorrow morning and. Uh, be done with this vlog. So I'm back home. Yep. And it's been a few days that I've been back home. And to be honest, with a couple of setbacks, like a few days later, I kind of realized how exhausting are these trips. And uh, now, I'm, why I'm thinking about this, I'm like, you know what, Justin? I love traveling for business. I love doing all these kind of things because you can always mix ledger, 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 and business, right? So you can do both in the same time, but you really have to put boundaries with yourself so then you can stay healthy and keep your habit at the right place. Getting back from there, exhaustion, almost getting sick because I'm you know, stressed out, lack of sleep, bad food, no habit, no workout, all these kind of things. So I would definitely recommend to all you guys and even myself, myself by the first, to definitely travel for business with a mindset that is, I will always take care of myself first. Because if you're not, you know, healthy or feel good about it, you won't have the right mindset to work and, you know, close deals and shit. Do what you are supposed to do at best. So it is, closing the video on this little uh, you know, tip and uh, learning experience that I want to share with you. Thank you for watching so much. Uh, I really appreciate it. I just got recently monetized by YouTube and that's thanks to you all. Uh, we're gonna have a 1,001 subscriber video soon. I know we're almost at 2,000 already by the time you watch this video. It's okay. <laughs> so don't forget, thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll see you around in another video. Thank you. I'm